Pilots, listen up. Going straight up, accelerating an F-16 is a low angle attack. Here's your cord line, here's your alt of wind, no angle attack. So remember, when we're taking off, we're going down the runway, airplanes going this way, relative wind is this way. As soon as we rotate, it becomes kind of a high angle attack when we rotate. Sometimes we bump a stall horn because we've got that angle between the relative wind and the uh, cord line. So we've got a high, higher angle attack. As the airplane starts speeding up, a lot of times that you know relative wind becomes more straight. So again, we've got a, a flying straight and level now relative wind. We've got a slow flight relative wind, which is a much higher angle attack. We've got relative wind when we're climbing out, which it isn't gonna be straight, but it's gonna be much different than slow flight. What if we're an F-16 going straight up? Well, straight up, accelerating, look at that, a very low angle attack. Most people would think a high, but remember it's not relative to the earth. It's just a very low angle of attack right there. And then what about if, it, if the aircraft was coming down in a spin? Well, let's first start with slow flight. Slow flight might look like this and then we might stall. A spin is the same thing, only the relative wind is from here as it comes down. And then of course it's rotating around its helical axis. If you're thinking about flying for a career, connect with us. We're going to teach you and we're going to help you make hard things simple.